It's Drummond with the rebound. He just has not been able to get into that groove yet, guys. But as a whole, it hasn't affected them too much. He had a couple in the first. But so far, he's been unable to get uncorked here. Miller with a wide open look. That ball is nice speed that time from George. Boy, such outstanding patience and decision making for them offensively. Now, absolutely. Their ball movement has been outstanding. They are piling up the assists. And Bryant wide open. He shoots. Kobe can't get that one to fall. Miller right side. For three. Irving kicks to Miller. Jacks up a three. And again, Toronto with the triple. And they're getting their points now almost exclusively from the three-point line. That's four of the last five. You've got to run those guys off the line. I agree, and the defense is practically giving them those shots, though. And again, Toronto running the court in transition. Well, I'll tell you what, they're turning this game into a drag race, sprinting out for easy, fast-break baskets. Uh, going on a nice run here, and defensively, you've got to force them to operate in the half court. This won't get it done. So, timeout called here, the first for Toronto. Well, he's got to be disappointed with his team's play over the course of this run, and, uh, you know, thus the timeout. You've got to talk things over, try to get back into the game. Something has to change for them as they haven't looked good at all during this run, so the timeout is appropriate here. And it's a completely new group for Toronto. Unable to get the ball in bounds, they get called for the five-second violation. Clock keeps going. Three minutes into the second half now. And the foul on Derrick Rose. That is his first foul of the game. You know, the league seems pretty serious about creating more parity between the teams. A big sign of that was the last CBA where... The NBA more than tripled the amount of revenue sharing between the big market and the small market teams. The little guys, I think, are in a much better position now than they were a few years ago. Miller outside. And it's Toronto with the rebound. To halt the run. And it's Toronto with the rebound. Chambers got his sixth rebound on the night. A three. Shots good by Miller. Miller's got 12 points here in the second half. This looks like a pregame shoot around with all the threes they're allowing. Yeah, I don't know, Clark. I think there might be even more defense in warmups. I mean, this is kind of embarrassing. A shot by Thompson, and no one's around. And again, Toronto no up. This has not at all been the kind of performance they've needed out of him. Miller with the ball. Now guarded by DeRozan. Chambers kicks to Miller. Puts up the baby hook. And another basket for Toronto. They're straying away from the three-point game here in the second half. And um, that's fine as long as they're on the lead and they're getting good shots. They've decided not to take nearly as many three-pointers in this half. And you can feel the momentum swinging. They needed that shot badly. Steve, I sense some frustration here. It seems like they're getting a little frustrated. It's understandable because they've given up this big run. And as hot as he's been this quarter, the game plan should be simple. Get him the ball and get out of the way. And again, Toronto running the court in transition. That ball is nice speed that time from George. Miller's got 25 points. A shot by Thompson, and no Wait one's around. From beyond the arc, and then some. Guys, you just don't realize, maybe Steve does, but you can't really, you can't imagine how difficult it is to hit a shot that deep. Man, that was, that was as sweet as honey. <laughs> Clark, I think it's the three quarters of play all in the books, and this one 